All right, Mr. Barker, you're on your own. <laughs> yes? Uh, Mr. Barker is in the conference room. We'll be right there. And your wife is on her way up. Good. Tell her to wait in my office. I want to see her. Mr. Bu... Hi. Say that, uh... <laughs> there must have been some party last night. What did you do? I don't know. But whatever it was, I won first prize. <laughs> what happened to your hair? The faintest idea. It looks good. See my chest, it's all uh, ruffles. <laughs> uh, why don't you sit down? Yeah. No! Oh! <laughs> Seems like I backed into a cactus bush or something. Is <laughs> Bab sore about last night? No, on the contrary, she thought you were cute. <laughs> Look, uh... Well, look, I need, uh... I need a little pick-me-up. The bar's in my office. I'll fix you something. No, look, I, I know where it is. Uh, Mr. Barker, we'd like to get this contract buttoned down this morning. Uh, you got a deal. I, I like Stephen's work. But give me a minute, will you? This... This is an emergency. <laughs> Ruffles. <laughs> Parker? Well, hello there. How are you feeling, Mr. Parker? Miserable, thanks. <laughs> but this will straighten me out. A little hair of the dog that bit me, you know what I mean? Yes. <laughs> oh. I usually drink it with carrot juice. I get just as smashed, but I can see better after dark. <laughs> <laughs> You know, you really are a knockout. Mr. Barker, you're amazing. Don't you ever get tired? Oh, oh, oh never. <laughs> oh, I was just telling her about the... What are you doing? Protecting my wife. Well, he was only with her for a minute. What could he have done? He was nibbling at her neck. You didn't have to hit him. What do you expect me to do? Well, use a little diplomacy. When somebody insults my wife, that's as diplomatic as I get. You all right, sweetheart? Oh, I'm fine. But you didn't have to do that. Mr. Barker. I should have done it last night. Oh, you wouldn't hit a little dog. No, you're telling the truth. Forgive me? Of course. Well, I won't. That punch just cost this company half a million dollars. What am I going to tell the stockholders? Tell them I quit. Mm. Come on, darling. Well, what about him? Why didn't you call the pound? <laughs> What are you doing here? Well, I just dropped by to tell you I signed with your outfit. Provided you handle the account. You expect me to work with you after what happened? Oh, forget it. I've got a problem. <laughs> Some of my best friends have knocked me cold. <laughs> hey, listen, if you and your wife were ever in Columbus, Ohio, I, uh... Oh, forget it. <laughs> Sam! They want me back on the job. Oh, well, I'm not surprised. Hey, you didn't have anything to do with this, did you? Of course not. Everybody wants you because you're the best there is. Now, how about taking me out to celebrate? Good idea. Forget my hat. Uh-uh. Don't you dare move. <laughs> Samantha? I know, I know. No hocus-pocus. <laughs> so sue me. It was worth it. 